What's up guys, welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to mount your TV on your truss. Before I start, I just want to say thank you for subscribing to the, my channel. I appreciate it and if you're not subscribed, subscribe and give this video a like and watch my other videos. Hopefully you learned something. So today we're going to teach you how to mount your TV on your truss. It's going to cost around $30, assuming that you already have a TV and a truss. I'm going to show you guys what I use. I purchased my mounting bracket from Amazon, $15. The ADJ O clamps, five to six dollars, and with a little bit of modification, you'll be able to mount your TV. So yeah, let me show you. So this is the one that I got off of Amazon. This is a Pearl Smith low profile TV mounting bracket. Okay, you buy this, and it comes with these here that go on the back of the TV. And you're able to tilt your TV with these things right here. It also comes with different bolts depending on the size of your TV. Now before you purchase this bracket, make sure you read the description. There's a couple TVs that do not work with this, okay? I'm filming. Hey, I'm filming. Shh. And um, this works with 23 to 55 inch TVs, okay? And so you're gonna buy this, it's $15. Then you're gonna need some ADJO clamps depending on the size of your TV. I used to have a 43 inch TV, so I only used this one and this one. But then I upgraded to a 50 inch, so I felt safer with another, with the third one. So what's great about this um, O clamps is that you can actually remove this part here if you have a two two inch trussing instead of one and a half. So it'll fit most truss sizes. Okay, and um, when you buy this bracket and you try to put the O-clamps through the holes, we put them in through these type of holes here. They won't fit and they will definitely not fit these holes either. So you need to modify it. So what we did was we got a file and we filed it down a little bit in here to be able to put these bolts in. So once we filed it down a little bit, we put these bolts in right here and we were able to put the O clamps on the bracket. But once you do that guys, all you need to do is put these on the back of your TV and you'll be able to mount it on your truss. Okay, and that's easy. There's really nothing much to it. It looks like it's complicated, but no, this costs, I don't know what, around $30 is what it's going to cost you to mount your TV. So right now we're going to show you guys how it looks on the T-bar, and yeah, so you guys get an idea. Alright guys, so once you put the mounting bracket, be sure to put it like in the middle. Then you want to tighten the, the O-clamps really tight so that this doesn't go up, so this doesn't slip down. And don't worry, these handle 25 pounds each, so that's 75 pounds. And it's more than enough for this TV. This TV looks heavy, but it's not heavy, it's pretty light. So once you have that done, now we're able to mount the TV on top of the truss. So once you hook the top part of the TV, now what you're going to do is, there's, some, uh, there's a string here. You're going to pull the string so that the bottom hooks. And it's very important. So once you pull it, see? That piece right there hooked. And that's very important so that the TV doesn't fall. Same as this side. Here's a, here's a string right here. We're going to pull it. And there you go. The TV is locked in place. And now you don't have to worry about it falling. So there's the TV. We raised it up, almost touching the ceiling as an example of what you can do at a gig. You can raise up your TV that high. I would personally do it because you don't want people dancing in front of it and the people that are sitting down, chilling, not being able to see the TV. There's Cecilia moving the TV light. Let it go. Move it more. Pretty solid, all right? Or maybe she's weak, who knows? <laughs> so pretty solid, all right? So when you guys when you guys are done with the gig and you guys want to unmount it, 
you guys are gonna do the opposite. You guys are gonna pull both these strings together. So we'll pull them. Somebody will pull them for you. Push the TV forward. And then let go of the strings. Once you let them go, then you get a person on each side to help you unhook the top part of the bracket and you guys be good to go. So there you guys go, that's how I mount my TV. I've had a couple of gigs where it's been really, really windy and nothing happened. So you guys are good on that. All right, so it's pretty, pretty solid, pretty affordable way to mount a TV to your truss. And that's how I do it. That's how a lot of people do it. And hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, share the video, help out your friends. Thanks for watching. Puro DJ Phoenix.